Rachel's sister, and I am so happy to have a brother like Brennan enter into my life. He's the brother that I never had, and watching a relationship like Rachel and Brennan's grow, and you know, watching it from the beginning, it, it was so beautiful, and it makes me believe in love. I can truly say that I've never seen Rachel happier in her whole entire life than she is now. <laughs> and um, I really mean that. I'm so excited and just thrilled and so touched about everything, you know, like my heart is like, it's just overwhelmed. And the future is, we're gonna have a long life together and we're gonna have grandkids and... <laughs> let's, let's cut you off. <laughs> I just wanted to thank each and every one of you guys personally for coming out, you know, um, on behalf of Rachel and myself. I feel very fortunate to have, you know, a lot of friends in my life and in Rachel's life, but it takes true friends and family to, you know, track halfway around the world to be here for our special day and, uh, and share that moment with us. So, uh, really, again, thank you guys from the bottom of our hearts for being here. Looking forward to a great morning and a great day tomorrow as well. To, of course, to Brennan and Rachel, my son and future daughter-in-law can't say such, uh, enough good things about you, but I will certainly try and elaborate more tomorrow on that. So again, thank you very much for all being here today. Cheers, Cheers to all. Cheers. To Brennan and Rachel. Cheers. To Brennan and Rachel. To Brennan and Rachel. Salute. 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 Radio Com, your captain, will be taking down to Cancun today. On behalf of First Officer Patrick Hildenberger, I'd like to welcome the board. Just respect to get your next couple minutes. Once we do get airborne, we're looking, uh, looking at about four hours. Oh, we're well, down there right now, way up all the 80 degrees under sunny skies. It's like you have a cancer puncher. Marriages like births mark the beginning of a journey together. Today we have marked the beginning of a wonderful new journey in which Brennan is joined together with Rachel, his beautiful bride. One night, kids, Rachel and Jen, were having a whole bunch of friends over, and they were down in the basement, and Rachel says to me, Dad, I want you to meet a friend of mine. Dads, you know, all know what this is code for. I talked to Brennan that night, and I, I like Brennan a lot. And then the next thing I know, I hear about Brennan, and I said, you know what, I think this might be the one. Well, then a little while later, I met Brennan. I said to Vivian, I hope this is the one. And then of course, it was very shortly after that, we both agreed, yes, that's the one. It's a wonderful one. Mm -hmm. I want to congratulate you both. I'm so happy for both of you, and Rachel, I'm so happy you found the right guy. Now we find ourselves here today, viewing the end result of time, very well spent, and unrivaled devotion. We have such a beautiful group here, and uh, two families joining as one, thanks to Rachel and Brennan today.
finally here. In a few hours, we're going to be married. From my best friend to my bride. To my BMAC. I can't wait to marry you today. These are safe to read out loud. Read in order. Love, Raybot, your future wifey. I truly am the luckiest guy on this planet. I can't wait to start forever after and build our dream life together. You are the most beautiful girl inside and out who has ever graced this earth. Can I get the show? <laughs> you always know how to make me feel better. Your eyes are the most beautiful I've ever seen. This truly is the greatest day of my life. XOXO, your husband. <laughs> You are my absolute soulmate, my lover, best friend, and everything for life. Oh, he's so cute! <laughs> Arby! <laughs>
one more thing. We're in Mexico now, so we all have to be learning a little bit of Spanish because that's what you have to do when you come to Mexico. Can everybody say after me, Basso? Basso. What? That means kiss. <laughs> <laughs>